All right, I'm out at Canby Park, kind of like Canby Lake Park, but it's called Canby Park West. Playing the long to long layout. We play the tips, that's how we roll. All right, I'm gonna record every shot, see if I can splice it all together. First hole is a par four, uh, 465 feet. Goes down, the fairway goes down and to the left, over a little creek, protecting the, the green. There's a guy on the fairway right now blowing the leaves. I played here a couple weeks ago and I lost two discs under the leaves. So this guy out there, probably volunteering, I'm sure they're not gonna blow the leaves as a part of the municipality uh, maintaining a regular park. But since it's a disc golf park, this part, uh, I think there's somebody volunteering to go out there and blow the leaves. So hopefully I can hit him with this because he's about 320 down the fairway. Heiser out on me at the end, but not bad. Um, I actually don't have a shot at the green right now, so I'm gonna lay up just short of the green and then hopefully get my four. Probably just a standstill. This hole's a big dog leg right, and it dog leg rights so much that a normal turnover disc, uh, once I get inside that big tree right there, I think that it, it would go into the woods deep, so I'm gonna just throw a mid-range. It won't get to the pin, I don't think, but at least it'll work around that tree to the right and put me in a good spot. I actually went inside that tree. I got through the trees, but I'm actually quite short. Pins right there, so I'm just gonna throw a little slight hyzer turnover. Clipped the tree up high, but it's an easy putt. Uh, par 3 290. The sign was kind of shitty so you can't see it but go straight through here and bend a little left. So little fade left going in essence. Flip the tree towards the end and kick straight down. Should be easy. It's a part three, 310. Dead straight. I'm gonna throw a little bit of a flippier disc. Try to get it to hyzer flip. It's probably gonna finish left when it fades out, but I'm gonna try to get the flip up, hyzer flip. This hole's a 260 foot par three. It's pretty simple. It just goes straight and then finishes left. I'm gonna throw a buzz, which is my, uh, my straight throwing mid. I'm gonna hope to just hang it out there and let it fade back to the left a little bit.
I had to wait a second because the guy down there is still blowing on the green. About as good as I can throw it. Hopefully I didn't hit that guy. It's a par three, straight up the hill, a little to the left. It's 310 feet, so I'm not gonna make it there, but hopefully I can get close. Gotta keep it low and hard. Yeah. Didn't stay straight long enough, but should be okay. So the hole's right around this bend. It's hard to see from down there, but the other pin is, I'm within circle one if I was playing the shorts. But I'm about 30 feet away, just gotta hydro it around some trees. Yep. Tap in. This is a 300 foot par three, works to the right. Just try to flip up a uh, underworld, work it a little bit, but see how it goes. Bends hard right, you won't even be able to see it on the camera. Well, you'll see that. Huge kick off a tree. So the hole's just to the left up here. It's still about 150 feet because I only got like 100 off the tee. So I'm just gonna have to hyzer it out around these trees. Yeah. Circle one, I got a putt, but. Serious. Uh, this is another par three that works to the right. I'm gonna throw this astronaut. It's a 12 speed minus four turn. Just try to keep it low. Start it on Heiser. Let it flip up, and hopefully it works to the right. Oh yeah. It worked harder to the right than I wanted it to, but it got full flight. 